Hey mom, dad, you guys wanted to know how this thing worked. So this is the critter. You, um, you thread the loop through here. And so this rope is locked into the carabiner right here. Um, and this is the part that would be attached to the rock or whatever you're rappelling down from. This is the brake. You keep this part in your hand. And so the, the friction points are obviously the carabiner itself, but then also right here. And that's the that's what the kids use and I can get away with it too but then there's a bunch of other positions as well uh, this is a plus position here which is twice the friction of the earlier one this is a plus plus um, which makes it really hard to move um, and then what I kind of like is this is position B which seems to be the right uh, friction for me, especially if I got a pack on. And then I can also go here. This is position B plus, and that's the, the same friction as A plus plus. And then you can also lock it off. Um, once you're in A plus plus, if you kind of make a little loop there, um, you lock it off like that, and it bites on itself. And you can see I'm pulling that really hard and it's not going anywhere so that's that's locked off so the whole idea here is just um, you know as you're going down you slowly let this rope out with your right hand um, and you slide down the rope this way and so when you asked what we were hanging on to with our other hand um, mostly they were hanging on to the carabiner or maybe, you know, right here on the critter, but sometimes they were even using two hands on the rope. Um, I was especially too. And that's how it works.